Hello, and welcome back to our Guild Wars 1 playthrough of Prophecies, or Nostalgia Run playthrough, that is. And this is a very special episode. We are in the Thirsty River, and we scheduled a meetup of whoever wanted to join was welcome. And we got a pretty good showing. It was us and some uh, players from Reddit, some of our... Some of the viewers of this channel as well as the host of course of the guild wars in 2024 guild wars mod himself he's he joined us with his ranger interrupt you um i'm just i wanted to film a quick introduction to that video uh because i did not do any kind of intro uh live no no live intro for that one but yeah you're gonna see and hear another voice that is guild wars in 2024 um, so don't be alarmed. There's going to be two voices in the chat. Uh, hopefully you guys enjoy it. Without further ado, the Thirsty River mission plus bonus. Um, so I hope you guys enjoy. Carl Sagan? Who's Carl Sagan? <laughs> oh, yeah, this guy. He's from uh, Reddit. I, he posted something like earlier today. He was like, I've been trying to do Thirsty River. I can't beat it. And then I was like, I'm going to play it in a couple hours. So oh, perfect. this must be him. Yeah, if we can get a full party of real players that are not, like, super overpowered, <laughs> this will be fun. Oh, nice. He got a monk. Oh, that's the same guy. He just switched. Yeah, that build at least looks more respectable now with an elite skill in it. <laughs> yeah. At first glance, it's like, okay, it's a real build. Well, I guess I like the layout. Two more players. Now it doesn't really matter who we get. Because we got a we got a monk. Yeah, I hope he's actually healing and not like smiting or something. <laughs> a monk ritualist. <laughs> Gotta be healed. Some at least some heals in there. This monk's gonna lend me a bow. And put a lot of faith in me and returning it, I guess. Yeah, it's a nice guy. Let's see if I'll reciprocate. Looks like we're doing like a ranger party build here. This guy joins, I'm not sure. I find people in this game will definitely like reach out, like give you things, help you run missions. You know, the community is pretty good in this game, so I think. Absolutely, yeah. And you showed me this Discord, the uh Guild Wars Global. It seems like a lot of people just find groups on there. I know I was reading. Yeah, honestly, I've, I really have never used it, but I was just reading through like some of the groups. There's like general PVE, pre searing, whatever, and then like it seems like people are pretty active on there. Do you ever use Reddit, like the Reddit Guild Wars? Uh, no, I have not. Okay. Is that very active. There's some stuff on there. Yeah, it's pretty good. It's not bad. I think we should go damage. I don't know. Maybe not Stefan, because we have this front line with this other ranger. Okay. And then me and my pet, or at least my pet. So maybe go, do like, like um, or maybe or do the other brawler. mesmer. The mesmer then, but the mesmer has uh empathy also. Then we yeah true, two but empathy. it might split. You know. Oh, he might cast against it on another multiple guy? targets. Okay. Yeah, let's do it. Ready? Nah, make him stay with that build. Let's do it. Oh, I didn't see his build. Is it good? Oh, that's a great build. I don't know. I think I think he can just heal less though. I think we'll be okay. Let's do it. Cool. Full party. Got four players. The very first time we've ever run this this mission. <laughs> wow, he gave you a storm bow? What the heck? Yeah, pretty nice, right? You're gonna you're gonna like change your account name and <laughs> Yeah, log off right away.
Man, I really like this mantra of recovery, actually. I've never used it. My skills should recharge so fast. It's a stance, or no? Yeah, it's a stance. For 14 seconds, your spells spells you cast recharge 33% faster. Okay. I, wa I wonder if it stacks with the with my fast casting attribute, too. I've seen it in a farming build for uh, Gates of Krita, actually. Uh-huh. I feel like we're going faster than we did a long time ago. <laughs> yeah, you're right. That mage has been throwing down the firestorm. Definitely doing all our damage. No, I'm joking. These pets level pretty fast, though. Like, I haven't been playing that much content, but, you know, this pet was level 5, like, when I started. Yeah. Last time I From played the anniversary, it, yeah. you know? I captured it during the anniversary event. And then you've just been playing it just through missions and, and stuff, and he's already level 16? Yeah, just from a few. Oh, it's a necromancer. I assumed it was a warrior. Weird. All right. Now things get a little bit more difficult. I remember, like, way back in the day, these desert missions just stumped me. Just took me like yeah weeks. these were tough back in the day yeah. i got stuck in the desert a couple times yeah i remember like just sitting in town waiting for players needing begging for healers <laughs> mm. this mission was kind of designed to give you a little bit of a like a peek at what PvP content would be like. Yeah. Nice interrupt. I saw that. And I've got like no energy. Too many. Chaos storms running around. Hey. I guess I should have brought another signet of capture for the elementalist skill. I didn't think about that. Oh yeah, what skill does he have? I think it's like ether. Oh like yeah, yeah, I know what you're talking about. It's like um, I don't. I mean, I don't think I could use it. I think it's an energy wrist, energy storage spell. And not get an interrupt off. Either could I. Okay. One fifty seven sub two minutes. I need a new Do you weapon. see that in the chat? I said thanks for the storm bow that the guy said he's going to lend me. And then he's like, you can keep it. Oh, nice. <laughs> Good one. I was trying to play the field a little bit there. Yeah, see if he would let you keep it. Yeah, exactly. Is it, it was better than the one you were using for sure? Yeah, I just have like a purple 
uh, short bow right now. Oh, I should have talked to this. He bugged? Oh, we just need to talk to him. It pauses the... I like that it pauses the time between zones, so... Didn't lose anything there. Alright, so now that we're fighting two bosses... I think we want to fight this group first here. On the left? Oh, wait a second. Oh, what? Oh, the earthquake. I need to uh, interrupt that guy. We got the interrupt off on that. Arcanist. See, I'm, I like backfire, but I never really get a chance to use it because it's got such a high energy cost. I should start with it. Is there a power drain? Are you using that at all? Yeah, I am using power drain. If I can get it successfully, like get it off that's the problem it's like for me playing interrupts it's not the most consistent energy uh respiration all right i just de-shotted his word of healing heck yeah interrupts with bow is always tough for me i can do it okay as a mesmer but with using a bow it's harder yeah there's the ad added like projectile time We're going pretty fast through this, I think. Whoops, wrong screen. This is pretty good. I mean, just having like a good healer really makes this possible. Ah, I missed the... Oh, it's okay. Is the or is the order of vampire is that um is that a enchantment? Yeah, it gets cast on everyone in your party, and then it does something like extra damage when they uh, do physical damage. Ah, okay, so it's like a party wide enchant. Yeah. So many interrupts. <laughs> That's crazy. Like four in a row. Yeah. We were on uh I couldn't even get my enchantment my interrupt off because he was getting interrupted so fast. Yeah, that's the thing about backfire too, it's not really gonna activate in a lot of those situations. Right. The scroll. Probably should have waited to use it because it's only 30 seconds. Oops. So I think we do what? Left, center, right? Sure. Or do. Actually, I don't know. Let's follow the monk. Let's go this way, actually. Okay. 
Yeah, I just wasted that scroll. I didn't realize it was 30 seconds. Man, they were really clumped up for us there. That was awesome. Maybe go center? Yeah, I was just, just... thinking that. Oh, I just missed that earthquake. The long cast, too. He got it off. Yeah. I wasn't even targeting him, so that's probably my bad. Marks and wager. Yeah, it's this, it's something related to energy. Honestly, after that last mission, I thought this one was going to be pretty tough. But I mean, maybe it is just because we have these other two players with us. But yeah, I don't know. After the thirst or the um, Alona Reach one, you mean? Yeah. Yeah, the next one I think is also pretty difficult. It's like a defend defending one, if I can remember it correctly. All right. Oh, getting targeted. Oh, our king, our king came there. Dang. They moved in on him. Okay, I'm getting backfire on the monk here. Alright, I'll go interrupt the priest. I think sometimes when you put like skills like backfire on the NPCs though, they sometimes don't cast any spells. Like they avoid casting spells. I don't know if they're doing it on purpose or not. Yeah, I don't know. Oh no, he's definitely casting spells now. Backfire just triggered twice. Stupid bow. Enchanted bow. There you go. Almost got the interrupt on that. I screw up. Oh, there's two two enemies here. Oops, cast. That's another thing I do. I accidentally always put backfire and empathy on the wrong enemies. I like put it backfire on a ranger and then empathy on a monk. Yeah, sometimes I notice too and I just don't cancel cast it. I'm like, whatever, maybe it'll work <laughs> at some point. We'll do something. But like the, the NPC casters do auto attack sometimes. 
Yeah, there it makes sense. Empathy always works on like PVE. Yeah. All right, we did it. Nice. Did we get bonus for this one? Yeah, we did. Oh yeah, we did. All right. Quick, quick screenshot there for the thumbnail. That's the other thing that, about CapCut is it has a nice, um, uh, what do you call it, photo editor too. Oh, okay, with nice. Like with like uh, thumbnail templates and stuff. GG. It's all okay. We did it. Just one time. <laughs> <laughs> I thought I was going to get level 20, but nope. Yeah, I'm so close. I'm like 94%. Oh, you too. You're 96%. So now Let's the... see. Should we do it? Should we go outside and just kill a couple Hydra and just hit level 20? Hit level 20. Yeah, I'm down for it. I've got another um, scroll of Rampager, Rampager's Insight too. Okay, um, let's do it. Let's kill a couple Hydra. For sure that'll boost us. Yeah. Should we leave the party? Let's just try to drag this monk along. Let's see what he does. Here he comes. Okay. Okay, he's leaving. Oh no, that's a different guy. Oh, they must have just they must have gone on to do the Dunes mission. I still have his bow, so he's not leaving anytime soon. Right. We wanna hit level twenty. There's also the uh, 15 attribute quests. The, uh, you know what I'm talking about? Yeah, but that's in... Uh, there's one... That's in like, the Shiver Peaks, right? There's That's the second one. There's one here in the desert. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah, I vaguely remember that now. You get it in Skyward Reach. It's pretty close to here. We can head that way. Oh, okay. You're running that way. Right, let me put the scroll on. Did you get Rampage Insight? I just used it? Yeah, I did. Okay. Wasn't sure if it matters being far away or not. Getting 50 XP. 50? It's gonna take Yeah, it. how about you? Uh I I need to check I need to check it again. I only need 623 more though. Yeah, 355 for me. I just got 40 from that guy. Maybe I should have left uh oh you went that way. Maybe I should have left one henchman away so we can get more XP. Getting close. 435 left. You can also get max armor from some of the collectors around here. Yeah, I saw that right outside of Augury Rock, I think. Yeah.
Wait for it. Right, this should do it. These last group. No? Six, nine. No, it's not. For me, it should. Let's do it. Here we go. Level 20. About to wipe from some meteors. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Definitely. We ran straight into these guys without caring. Putting the pressure on our healer. You get it? Oh, oh so no. Close. Let's see. I'm fif 15 XP away. Oh, this is it. Oh, this one. Let me get a nice interrupt on this one. Game. Right. There we go. Nice. I'm 230. <laughs> a little bit of the ways. Oh, we lost the, uh, the, what do you call it? A scroll. No. One eighty. That's four of them. That's a lot. I think the last one's not. Oh no, it is. Oh, I see. I thought it was. It was just three. You know, white right at level twenty. Oh, you put spirit bond on me. I'm safe. You guys are gonna white. <laughs> Eighty. Yeah, backfire is really not useful whenever you're get whenever we're having all these interrupts. Just a waste of energy, I think. Maybe we can actually just shoot down at these guys. Let's see. I have a long bow. Okay. Oh, I rubber banded him. They're all just stuck there, kind of an anti climatic way of getting level 20, but... <laughs> Shooting fish in a barrel. <laughs> <laughs> like a centaur hunting trip. Yes. Level 20. We did it. All right. Okay, very good. Good stuff. All right, man, I'm going to hop off now. That was good. We're yeah. both level 20 now. And then you Dudes know? of Despair, just got to do that. And then Augury Rock. And we're uh, in the Shiver Peaks, but...
I don't know if I'm going to be able to do another mission. I don't know when I'm going to be able to do the next mission, so. Uh, either way. Yeah, get some help with Dunes of Despair. That one's pretty tough. Yeah. Me, myself, I just have Augury Rock now, so oh, I'll you do, do that some time. Okay, cool, man. Yeah. All right, well, yeah, we'll, we'll get back on some other time. Cool, sounds good, dude. All right, GG, see ya. Peace.